Hi, this is Danger Man, the Urban Superhero, and this is another Danger Man moment. I wanted to comment uh, briefly on this uh, outrage in Mississippi on the pardons. Uh, former Governor Haley Barber. This guy is a real piece of work. He pardoned over 200 criminals. And four of them were convicted killers. Uh, the former governor said they were, it was, they were crimes of passion or something, and they weren't likely to do them again, which was uh, not true. And then he talked about most of them had served at least you know, 20 years of their, their sentences, which, again, was not true, all right? And, um, you know, uh, these guys were vicious murderers, okay? And, uh, you know, where does he get out? Then he broke a rule, Rule 124 or something, which says something about it has to be, uh, there has to be a notice posted for 30 days, all right? I guess for, by the convict, uh, if they want to get parole or whatever, that, that Rule 124 that he did, he dis disregarded that rule totally, which is part of their constitution there in the state of Mississippi, all right? And, um, and then there might have been a little racism involved in because, you know, I mean, uh, most of the uh, people pardoned were uh, were not, um, you know, were Caucasian and people and, and from uh, families of influence. All right, and uh, but these guys were working. These convicted murderers were working at the governor's mansion, like in the, what was that like in the sixties and the fifty, 50 you know, back um, uh, during, you know, uh, during the. Uh, um, uh, the old times, okay, old days, all right, and uh, and he just took it upon himself to to go ahead. And I guess his rule, he told him, so yeah, if you work here, then you'll get pardoned, okay, you know, and uh, just a total disregard for the for the law and the uh, the people, the victims, you know, the victims, you know, the people who had to live through. This and their family members can't get pardoned. Their their family members won't be able, aren't walking around again. All right, you know. Uh, yeah, this this this. So there's the attorney general is seeking to have these uh, overturned, and uh, I hope this is done. Uh, there's I guess it was a matter of you know getting letters out to, to and uh, that there's going to be a hearing out to these um, the the, the uh, inmates or the uh, the prisoners who had been uh, um, um, who had been pardoned. But I hope that this this, this moves uh, pretty quick. So uh, um, you know, you know, a judge. There was a judge in this case that uh, um, that found you know, and a jury that found these people guilty. And the judge gave them their sentences, and they need to to um, go back uh, until their sentences are uh, um, um, fulfilled. All right. And uh, God, I watched the victims, and they were like, I mean, they're still like this happened yesterday, and these crimes happened years ago, but these people are hurt because their daughters, their mothers, who their sons will not be coming back again, all right? So Haley Barber, man, you're a real piece of work, okay? I hope you never run for another office again, all right? And, uh, you know, any legacy that you thought you would have had is gone, all right? So anyway, this is Danger Man, Urban Superhero. Um, you know, I just wanted to uh, voice my displeasure with this former governor and hope that this uh, is remedied very quickly. All right. So anyway, you guys be safe out there. Watch your backs. And, uh, you know, we'll talk to you later. This is Danger Man Urban Superhero. And this, my friends, has been another Danger Man moment. Thank you.